New federal charges have been filed in the death of George Floyd against four former Minneapolis police officers, accusing them of violating Floyd's civil rights. These new charges coming just a little more than two weeks after Derek Chauvin was found guilty of murdering George Floyd on state charges. Meredith Wood has the latest. Former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin now facing new federal charges in George Floyd's death. The indictment accusing Chauvin of depriving Floyd of the right to be free from unreasonable seizure, which includes unreasonable use of force. You don't want to see another uh, a person get murdered the same way that George Floyd lost his life. Three other former officers that were on the scene of the detention of Floyd are now also facing federal charges on top of their state charges. Two of the officers accused of not intervening to stop Chauvin's use of force, and all four are charged with not giving Floyd medical aid. Floyd family attorneys responding to the indictments in a statement saying, quote, we are encouraged by these charges and eager to see continued justice in this historic case. Derek Chauvin is also facing new federal charges with civil rights violations in a 2017 incident against a 14-year-old. The newly unsealed indictment alleging Chauvin held the teen by the throat, striking them in the head multiple times with a flashlight. In that case, Chauvin allegedly also put his knee on the teenager's neck and upper back even after he was lying prone, handcuffed, and not resisting. The White House says the new indictments are a reminder of the need for police reform. Uh, it's a reminder of the need to put police reform in place uh, through our legislative process and put those reforms in place across the country. I'm Meredith Wood reporting.